They're developing some talent there. Ooh. Oh, yeah, he got a little pop that, in that bag. I mean, Tui Pelotu, just the number one wide receiver in the group, alphabetically, numerically, but also the number one wide receiver amongst the entire group at the Combine here in Indianapolis on Daniel Jeremiah's draft board. Jordan Addison from USC. Four four nine. That's much better. He's not going to be by himself either. North Carolina's got a quarterback, and Drake May's pretty darn good too. So, uh, old old people they always talk about how they had to walk to school five miles uphill in the snow. I mean, when you're a young scout back in the old days when I started, we yeah. had to go make sandwich runs. These guys are all in suites now <laughs> with catered food. I feel like these young guys are not having to earn their earn their stripes here as they're coming up through the personnel department. Addison is. You know what it's like trying to juggle 12 sandwiches as you're walking back? Did you back? really? Yes. Well, we're going to test you here because we're going to put the tracer on you. This is the player tracking data. This is Jordan Addison from USC. He definitely moved a little bit up on day three with what we've seen out here. Looks like we're seeing a little whip route now. And here's Jordan Addison, a little in cut here. Again, you see how smooth he is. Look oh, at that. Oh, nice grab. Guelph to Tua. Oxford, Mississippi. Yeah. <laughs> it's our first time seeing USC's Tui Tui Pelotu. Go, go Chance to see him run, me. but on, hey, he was outstanding. His brother Marlon is with the Philadelphia Eagles. Quick, quick. Tweet Pelotu. Tweet Pelotu, great story with him. When you're talking to folks at USC, the year before Lincoln Riley came, they'd already dismissed Clay Helton. They had a game that got rescheduled with the Cal game. And let's go, let's go. So we just got um, word on the official time. And uh, Nolan Smith again. It's always scissors. Good. Settle. Come on. Tui Pelotu from USC. I think he'll be. It was just for defensive line. I believe so. I wanted to see it one more time. My kids were in school. I want to show them the hoop drills. Just to with drill the them on broke. DBs want to break. They, they don't they want to stay on that line. They want to get going. Hey, real quick, you know, this was a receiver's drill, right? We never did those DBs, right, DJ? Yes. And the more I talk with coaches, college, pro. We're going to see some. Yeah. Kai Blackman, it was uh, just like Christian Gonzalez, a transfer from Colorado. He went to USC. It's a great time. I think, you know, he played probably in... Mid four fives is what you thought when you watched him, so that's a great time for I had mentioned earlier, Jeremy Lincoln, former NFL corner. He's in the business now of training these corners. Deontay Banks, Jacorian Bennett, both from Maryland, two of his guys, and they're showing pretty well so far. Okay, that's our first one on the ground. Stacy Dales. Remarkable aspect of this is Blackman's second 40 time. It's a little bit slower based on our hand time as Devin 